Good morning from uh, Belly City. I woke up like half an hour ago and I arrived to Belize yesterday evening like super late and I'm staying here for two nights and what we are going to do is that today we have uh, a tour of uh, of Belly City. There is actually not much in Belly City so in the afternoon we are going to an island, Kikolker. It's uh, it's basically like a Caribbean island. I have a map here so um, I'm gonna explain better. We came yesterday from Mexico, we crossed the borders and we took this road all the way down to Belly City and today we are gonna have a tour of Belly City and after that we go to Key Colker, which is an island located like one hour from Belize by a speedboat and then tomorrow we are gonna visit Belmopan. We are gonna stop uh, in the Belly Zoo as well. So Belly Zoo Belmopan, uh, we have uh, Shunantunich, which are Mayan ruins, it's basically an archaeological site, and after that we are gonna cross to Guatemala. You know what is Belize famous for? It's the Great uh, Blue Hole, and we have no time to go there, and it's located a bit offshore of Belize, so if you look at the map, we are here, right, in Belize city, and that's where the Great Blue Hole is at. It's super famous for fishing and diving and snorkeling and all these kind of like water activities but you need time to get there. So let me show you the view because the view from this hotel room is cute. So if you look to the right side that's basically Belly City and the sea. The hotel is near the sea but it's not possible to swim because uh, well it's basically a port and also the water is not super nice, so um, we just leave the swimming for Key Colker. Anyway, we are gonna go have some breakfast and after we are gonna go and check out Belly City. I've been to Belly City before, um, you cannot expect much because um, it's, it's the biggest city, but it's not the capital city, right? It was the capital city in the past, but there were like two huge hurricanes in 1931 and in 1961 and they destroyed basically like the majority of the town so then they decided to move the capital city to Belmopan which is um, more which is not near the coast but it's like more um, inside you know this is the view from the front of the hotel so we have basically the ocean that's the park we are gonna go to the pool which belongs uh, to the hotel and uh, after that if you look up there there is like a couple of soccer fields belize is the only country in central america where you are going to hear more english than spanish and that's because belize was colonized by the english in the past and here in this park um, the british had their military Bases, and over here on the road there was the main airport. This is the St. John's Anglican Cathedral which they say that it's kind of a symbol of strength because it survived both of the hurricanes and even if Belize City is not the capital anymore it still has some importance and this is the Supreme Court. We are passing by the famous swing bridge which doesn't operate anymore but in the past they opened it every day in the morning and in the evening so the bigger sailing boats were able to pass. Anyway, it's 10.30 in the morning and we just boarded our boat from Belize City to Key Colker where we are going to spend the rest of the day. The last boat from Key Colker to Belize City is at 5 in the afternoon, so that's the boat we are going to take back to Belize City.
Kikolker just really has like Caribbean vibes. There are no normal roads, like you know, there are no asphalt roads. There is a very small village which has, which has like 2000 inhabitants and there are no normal cars on the island. So you either have to ride a bike or you can rent a golf cart. But a fun fact is that there is a very small airport. I am on the way to the village so we can check out the village. Oh look, I'm passing by like a cemetery. So anyway, I love to check out cemeteries whenever I am abroad. I know it might be bizarre, but it's actually like a huge part of the culture. So I think it's uh, it's actually nice um, to see, you know, but uh, look at this. It's so cute. Seashell. And there is the airport on the other side. Okay, this behind is the airport. It's super, super small, like no big planes. And here. There is actually like a welcome sign, you know. It is already the next morning and we are traveling from Belize city. Today we have several stops. First we are going to the zoo, then to Belmopan, which is uh, the capital city, and then to Shunantunich, which are the Mayan ruins. Belize is a fun country. It has no skyscrapers and the tallest building in the country is a temple that belonged to the Maya civilization. Also imagine a capital city where you have traffic lights only on one point. Yeah, that's Belmopan. Slowly we are arriving to the zoo in Belize. It's not a very traditional zoo, but we are here to see one very important thing, which is the tapir. The tapir is the national animal of Belize. This is the traditional food of Belize and that is rice and beans which is usually served with a salad then a pasta salad and also chicken or beef and of course fried banana. Shunan Tonic is a Mayan archaeological zone. It is located near the borders with Guatemala and Shunan Tonic is one of my favorite Mayan archaeological sites. It is so peaceful and there are never too many people. It is literally hidden in the jungle and the cool thing is that you can climb up most of the pyramids and the temples. In most of the archaeological sites, it is not possible to do it anymore. 